So let's quickly scan through some of the devices that are already available that will take advantage of Windows 8. And frankly, we can expect a lot more coming out in the near future. Now that we have looked at Windows 8 in some detail, you may ask yourself the question that an OS is only as good as the machine it runs on. So for those wondering what some of the machines from the OEMs are, here are some of the interesting form factors made possible by the convergence of touch and desktop technology. We start first with the form factor that Microsoft is just exploring now with Windows 8, the tablet. And here we have one from Samsung. Sleek and elegant and like many of its products, a simple design that is usable and feels nice in the hands. There's also some serious horsepower under the hood here. Running Windows RT, it has a dual-core 1.5GHz CPU with an Adreno 305 GPU and is available in 32 or 64 GB storage with a micro SD card slot for further expansion up to 64 GB. There's a 5 megapixel rear camera and a 1.9 megapixel front facing camera. So overall, an interesting first look at one of the first tablets out of the block. Next, we move on to our first hybrid, the ASUS Vivo Windows RT Tablet Slash Notebook Hybrid. It has a vibrant 10.1 inch Super IPS Plus display with a resolution of 1366 into 768 pixels and has a sleek 8.3mm body. The design is also unique with a callback to the mighty Transformer Prime. And like the Prime, this one also has a Tegra 3 quad core beast waiting to be unleashed. It comes with 32GB of internal memory. It has a 8 megapixel rear camera along with 2 megapixel secondary front camera. Of course, the big USB here is it can detach itself from its keyboard casing and be used as a tablet. Now here's another interesting form factor, the slider. And what exactly do we mean by that? Heard of phones with slide out keyboards? Well, how about a tablet that does exactly the same thing? And that is the Sony YOS with a sturdy hinge design that helps you slide out a keyboard when you need it. It has ultrabook guts inside which helps with specs like a Core i5 or a i7 CPU, 128GB of SSD, 1080p IPS display, Gorilla Glass and much more. Expect to get a fully featured ultrabook with a tablet, ally it with a little bit of extra weight with this baby. Now this beauty with a beautiful 11 inch IPS display is another hybrid device with a detachable screen that can be used as a tablet on its own. It sports an Intel x86 processor and runs the full version of Windows 8. It has Beats Audio integrated like its paper cousin and has an 8 megapixel rear camera. The biggest thing we can say about this device is the fact that it feels like a high quality premium ultrabook in your hands and the design is just stunning. Now another device with a unique USB, the Dell with its swiveling screen that can be turned around and made to rest on top of the keyboard base and be turned into a tablet. And when you turn the other way around, it's an ultrabook. It runs a full spec version of Windows 8 along with Core i7 processor, a 256GB SSD and a 12.5 inch screen. India's number one news app just got even better. Download NDTV's new app. Fully optimized for retina display. Full screen view. Faster response time. And Sudoku. NDTV's new iPad app. Download now.